New at 10, it's been another successful year for the Mill Valley Film Festival, bringing a little slice of Hollywood to Marin County. This is the 46th year for the festival, which wraps up over the weekend. KTV's Zach Soss joining us live tonight after attending tonight's red carpet. Hey, Zach. Hey, and I can tell you part of what makes this uh, festival so successful year after year, according to organizers, is that uh, amazing access that you get to top filmmakers and smaller venues. And based on what attendees had to say to me this year, it did not disappoint. From the red carpet to the intimate two screen Sequoia, devotees of Mill Valley's annual film festival once again lining up Friday. We look forward to it every year. A festival that holds an extra special place in the hearts of these two. It's where Regan met Patty. Our first date was going to the film festival. Ten years ago. Ten years ago, yeah. yeah. And still finishing each other's sentences. And she's a good picker. This last one we just saw with Julianne Moore. Oh my God, it was the best one oh, so far. Oh, amazing. We've seen it's, amazing, amazing. Amazing films. Yeah. yeah. Were they born or were they made? May, December, among a long list of acclaimed films showcased over the event's 11 days. I just know I can do it, and I couldn't do it without you. Also playing Friday, Nyad, which tells the story of renowned long-distance swimmer Diana Nyad. I think that it was a great depiction. Bonnie stole Nyad's coach, depicted by Jodie Foster in the film, but notably absent this year from the festival, the actors now on strike. In their place, the filmmakers. People love the directors because they're so excited to be amongst the people. That access, part of what makes this festival so special. It's little small town Marin, and you get like big Hollywood people here. Just the chance to see a movie that I hadn't heard of before. They have everything from documentaries to true life story. And most importantly, on the big screen. And I feel like I get much more involved in the story. At a time when movie theaters continue to shudder nationwide, for these film fans, there just is no substitute for a good festival. It just kind of got to be our kind of our thing, you know. <laughs> totally. We'll pick this over any of the others. And if you still want to attend the festival, tickets are still available for select films. The festival runs through Monday. Alex? Yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. A great chance for people to, to interact with the filmmakers as well. Zach, thank you. All right.